bought these paintings yes. around here. And when you talk about down at the coast and stuff, you tell them you're from the mountains and people love artwork down there. They're like, when you go back, can you buy me a bulky? And I said, well, you're going to have to give me some money. All right. Uh, but everyone knows this painting's around. What about the second one? Simmons, Chris Simmons. A lot of people don't know this. Chris Simmons, he is a world national rifle shooter. In 2004, he participated in the NJROTC at Medell High School. And he is ranked right now, I think, seventh in the world this year again. But Chris has won several national championships. What about the third one with the helmet on? Angie. Angie Wilson, one of the first NASCAR race car drivers in, in, in history. So Angie started early. How about the one on the far right, top right? Dax. Dax Bennett, motocross racer. Dad, Todd Bennett, did the same thing. So you could put Todd in this class. I wouldn't tell Todd just because we went to school together, but I think Dax was better than he is. <laughs> uh, and so he's learned well from his dad, though. What about bottom left? Ryan Hart. I can't remember the first name. Kelsey. Kelsey. Yes. Kelsey Reinhardt, cheerleader for the Charlotte Bobcats. All right. What about the one in the middle, bottom middle? James Ferguson. Yeah. What do you think, Mike? Should we let him off the hook? Richard Irwin. Sorry. Richard Irwin. First. I thought it was Ferguson. <laughs> I thought it was Ferguson. Sorry. Richard Irwin, first African American elected statewide official ever from Marion, North Carolina. All right, Richard Irwin did it, all kinds of things. How about the uh, bottom right? Gus Greenleaf. Gus, yeah, Gus, Gus Greenleaf. Green Gus came from here. Uh, he actually founded the Negro Leagues in professional yes. baseball from Marion, North Carolina, 1933. He uh, coached one of the teams. Uh, now, what, since I've done this presentation, I've had people call me and everything, and it's Interesting, they said, do you know how Gus made his money, you know, to start all that? And I'm like, no, I have no clue. And they told me it was illegal gambling. And I'm like, oh, really? Okay. <laughs> uh, well, maybe we don't need to consider that, or maybe we need to talk about this. But uh, it's just amazing how he took something, and there was another guy with him that, that did the illegal gambling, and he was in it like a month, and then got out of it. And the money that he made, he started putting it back into the community and spots where the teams took over. And I said, well, man, somebody's got to do some research on this. Go ahead, Bob. 